Okay, wait, you want to see in here? So what are we fixing to do? We're going to put up the Christmas tree. Yep. Welcome to, uh, we still have these a November vlog. Mom, we still have these Thanksgiving stuff. <laughs> so, everyone, um, I actually put up my Christmas tree Halloween night. I wanted to save that for a different uh, uh, vlog, a different day. So today is November 2nd. And anyways, um, because my uh, Halloween, Halloween vlog was long enough anyway, so I'm like, I'm just going to uh, film this and just, uh, and just keep it as a, I guess a separate video for another day. But here is the, um, the, I'm going to go ahead and show you me putting up the Christmas tree. So, um, all I showed you was me putting up the Christmas tree. I didn't do any decorations yet because my stepson isn't here and he want, he's going to be here Tuesday. So, probably just put up the decorations on Wednesday. So, that will be on, and then I'm going to film us putting up all, all of our decorate, or, um, decorations that we have for the tree, the uh, ornaments pretty much. And I might get some other stuff later to finish decorating the tree. But anyways, um, I, I don't really, I probably don't need anything else because I actually have lights that's already attached to it. So I don't have to put any lights on. And I love trees that are already pre-lit that already has lights already attached to it. It's just so much easier. Um... Anyways, he wanted to uh, be there, so we're probably going to do that Wednesday because that, that'll be our free day. Because Tuesday, we're going to have a meeting, and we're probably going, we're probably more likely going to shut down, not do any filming, probably, right now. Because our COVID cases in our county just keep spiking up and spiking up, like, every day. It's just sad, though. It's really sad that it happens. But we're trying to do what we can. Anyway, so I didn't vlog anything yesterday. So there's not going to be a vlog uh, on Monday. But there will be one on Tuesday, which I'm, vlog I'm vlogging right now. 
so let me tell you what I'm going to do at the end of the videos. I got an email. Uh, I'm going to tell, I'm going to, t every day I'm at the end of the video, I'm going to tell you what I am thankful for. And, um, go on Facebook. I'll post something like, um, what are you thankful for today? And I'll, and all you have to do is go on the Facebook to the children's fam. And if you are, if you have subscribed, um, I would love to, uh, communicate with you guys through my, uh, Facebook family page because my, since I have children, my comments are shut off. Someone will, can't comment on here, but you comment on that page. And also I have Instagram. Also, and I'll, uh, put my Instagram information down below here for you. And all my social media is also, is in the description. And I would love to, uh, talk to you guys, you know, do that if you would like to. Get to know my subscribers. Because I have like 22 of you. Right now. And, I mean, it's a good thing. I think that's awesome. Right now. And, anyways, um, but, yeah, um, I'm going, today, I'm just mainly just cleaning today. I've cleaned my room yesterday, finished cleaning that yesterday. Then, this morning, I vacuumed my, uh, hallway floor, and I cleaned the kids' kids' room. It looks a whole lot better than what it did. I got a few things to do in there. Um, I got some, uh, summer clothes I'm going to hang up that they'll be able to wear, wear next year. And, um, I'm going to go through their toys. So, there's something else I'm going to do, too. But, that, I'll probably do that for a later day. Um, so, tomorrow, I'm going to film something. Uh, so, the kids don't actually go to actual school because the campus... It's going to be closed because we only have one voting poll. And that is um, it's called the Bearcat Event Center. And that's where they're going to have the voting polls at. So they thought it was just better just to close campus. But the girls are going to be bringing home their Chromebooks. Because they have Chromebooks that, that they do the work in. So we're going to do, it's called MIA Day, something like that. And I will film a little bit of it and just show you what, you know, that what they do throughout the day. You know, um, show you the schedule of it, you know, and what they do. And, um, they'll have a lunch break that they'll have. Um, let's see, what else? And I, at the end of the video, I'll explain to you what my experience was with it. Maybe give you some, if I can, I'll give you guys some tips if I can, you know, if I can. This is, uh, all new to me. This is the first time I'm actually doing, like, actual schoolwork from home. And helping with the girls because Bella, I, I, I'm going to have to have my full attention to her, really, because she, um, has a learning disability, and Brianna basically need, may need some reading done. I mean, she does have a little bit of a learning disability, but hers isn't near as bad as, uh, as, as Bella. Bella has to, you know, be in the resource room for the math and English. But Brianna, um, is very good at reading. She's like in third grade level in reading now. And she just needs a little bit of help. Like, she could do the regular, like, English. She just needs help with it. And then math. She was really struggling with math this year. This is the first year she's struggling with math. But she's getting an extra 20, uh, 20, uh, minutes a day of getting help doing the math. And she says she's doing, well, right now, it seems like she's doing a lot better with math this quarter. Than what she did uh, last quarter. She could do the regular math. She just needed the extra help. Because last year, you know, it's like everybody missed like, what, five months of school? Something like that. And, you know, they didn't get to learn everything that they 
They wanted to learn. And Brianna wasn't the only one struggling. There was other kids in her class, you know, the teacher said that was also struggling. So, you know, made me feel a bit better, you know, hey, she's not the only one struggling with this, you know, but she's doing better. She's improving. Bella. Oh, so hi. I got snacks. Yeah, where, where are we at? Nice to see you. Grace practice today. Okay, guys, what are you thankful for? First off, I'm thankful for Jesus and all that He's done for me. Me too. You too? Bree says her too, also. God has done a lot for me. Um, so, what are you thankful for today? If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you have not subscribed, please subscribe. And we'll see you in the next one. Bye.